I'm just sitting here thinking about that guy, Pat. I really do love him. He is so nice. First up, bad writing is the name of the game at Salon of Shame. That week, I still talked to him and still liked him. I even rested my head on his shoulder on the bus. Big move. The Salon of Shame is a reading night of your worst writing, usually from high school, sometimes college, sometimes childhood. I'm reading from my autobiography from when I was 11 years old, so. Definitely with reading your shameful stuff, it's really cathartic. There's this sense of, oh my god, I can't believe I wrote this. And then when you hear people laughing and, so and responding, you realize, wow, we no all felt me. this way. And it's really almost therapeutic in a way. I'm lazy. I'm out of shape. I have no motivation. I lose everything. I hate people. I'm ugly. <laughs> This isn't theater. This is a confessional bar event. I do not know if I can give myself to someone completely ever again. Where it could be your closest friends around you. It's strangers, but it could be your closest friends. Let's snuggle on the couch and pretend we're happy again. Let's laugh together at bad TV and just love being with one another. I think the best thing about the Salon of Shame is that there's a sense of universality that regardless of who you are, we all came from these embarrassing teenage defeats and embarrassments, and it's Sometimes really the great equalizer. I can't believe that I'm sitting here on my 16th birthday sobbing. <laughs>